How's it going everyone? My name is Forge and welcome back to a brand new video where today I am going to be showing you guys on how to use the slash title command. Now this is a command that may seem really complicated at first. Like you may have seen this in a few adventure maps right there. And now on Java Edition it is actually very complicated to actually understand. I can tell you that right now. But if you're playing on Bedrock Edition it's actually very very easy to actually do this. So if I come right over here we have ourselves our command block. And the hello sign that's being activated with this command right there. We have slash title, at p, title, and then we have a blue hello. Now, the way I made it blue is I have this symbol right there. Now, you may know that you can get the symbol on the Xbox One, but you can't get it very easily on a Windows 10 or a mobile device. So you have to go ahead and go online and to find the symbol, stuff like that. But, of course, I will have a link down below in the description. So you can go ahead and look at all the different color codes because there are a few color codes that you can go and use. So then there's also some special characters that you can use as well. But if you go ahead and type in 1 through 9, you can go ahead and get yourself a special color just like this right there. So as you can see, we have green, we have cyan, we even got ourselves red, or we have purple or magenta, whatever you want to say that is. We have orange, then we have ourselves gray, we have ourselves dark gray, and then we have ourselves nine as I mentioned, which is more like a, a, a bright, I guess you could say a light blue. I'm not sure why you would call that blue a periwinkle. Not sure. Um, but, of course, there are a few other letters they can use, like A. And, of course, you can use C and a few others. But if you want to go ahead and make it bold, you can go ahead and put an L, and I'll make it bold. And then you can go ahead and do an O, and I'll go ahead and give it an italic type symbol. So, that's pretty great. So, then, of course, you can combine them as well. So, to combine them, you can just go ahead and copy the symbol again and put it right there. And then go ahead and put the O to make it italic and then you can put that again and then you can go ahead and make it that color right there and now if I go ahead and back out and then I go ahead and click on spend it's going to go ahead and give us that uh, that title now if you're playing on Java edition you're going to have to like know on how to do MBT editing and all that for a command block I mean there is a lot of things going on with that and it's absolutely like annoying I mean I don't know why it can't be like this why can't it be as easy as it is over on bedrock I have no idea. I mean, you have to do all sorts of different things. It's not even funny. And then we have still the action bar title command. So I'll just go ahead and replace where it said title before with action bar. And then you can just go type in whatever you want with whatever color you want. But anyway, if I go and click on this, it displays right above our op bar. Just like that. I mean, it's a little bit high up there. But that's because you have your health and your hunger in the way and stuff like that. Um, but besides that, um, I don't know if there is a way for you to actually change the size of it. But besides that, you, you can actually have it above your hotbar. And then we have ourselves the subtitle version. So subtitles, it's actually a little bit different than the other ones. Because it's not going to work unless you have yourself the slash title command right next to it. It's not going to work with the slash action bar. So that's kind of disappointing. But with the regular title, it will work just fine. But watch this. All right. I have myself a command block that I already copied the data from. But if I go and click on this button, you see, nothing happens at all. But if I were to go and put this right there, and now I click it, now it's going to go ahead and say the word Audi that we have on there, which is pretty great. So this command right there, it is just very, very simple. And there you guys go. That's actually on how you use the slash title command in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. So please let me know what you think of this down below in the comments. And of course, you can go ahead and use this in any of your maps if you want, which is just really, really great. And I really love the fact that it's very, very simple. Yet again, on Java Edition, it's like very difficult to actually just do all the stuff. You have to like go online and find generators and all this. And it's just like really, really tedious. Nobody ever wants to do that. But you know what? People do it anyway. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then let me know by leaving a like on it and subscribe for more videos in the future. And for now, hope you have a logical day. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.